Hey everyone, Derek here with a quick news update on the July 2019 NPD sales as it's rather interesting for Nintendo, the Switch, and a lot of its exclusive games. Now, according to NPD analyst Matt Piscatella, six of the top 10 best-selling games in July were exclusive to the Nintendo Switch console. Those include Fire Emblem Three Houses, Super Mario Maker 2, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, and The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And this is an impressive feat considering they're all exclusives, and this only counts physical sales. It doesn't take digital sales into account, so it could be even higher. In fact, Fire Emblem Three Houses is at number two for July and is already the largest launch of a Fire Emblem game in US history, with its launch month sales tripling those of the previous bestseller in release month, which was Fire Emblem Echoes Shadows of Valentia. In fact, Fire Emblem Three Houses has instantly become the second best-selling game in the franchise lifetime sales, trailing only Fire Emblem Awakening, and considering that this is just the launch month, it won't take long for it to catch up and even surpass that. And considering Awakening saved the franchise, this is massively good news for Fire Emblem. Not only that, but Matt Piscatella later updated that The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild has become the best-selling Zelda game some time ago. We don't know exactly when, but it has now surpassed Twilight Princess to become the best-selling Zelda game of all time, with the top five being Breath of the Wild, Twilight Princess, Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, and Link's Crossbow Training, which, okay, that was on the Wii, sure, why not? Either way, this is all very good news for Nintendo, as the Switch is still performing incredibly strongly, and a lot of the franchises that have ended up on the system are doing really well. So it's great to see that level of success, and we'll have to see how well Link's Awakening, Luigi's Mansion 3, and Pokemon all do, as they could break records for their respective series as well. Likely not Link's Awakening, but definitely Luigi's Mansion 3 and Pokemon Sword and Shield. But what do you guys think of this NPD data? Let us know in the comments, and of course be sure to subscribe to Game Explain for more on Nintendo and other things gaming as well. Until next time, bye.